and welcome to Monday Night Raw. I'm your host, Font, with my co-host, No Shed. Say hello to the No Shed. Hello, how are you? And we're opening the show with Austin Theory, it seems. Ah, Austin Theory. So last week, Austin Theory, I guess, came out to try and say something about the uh, challenge that Paul Heyman claims Roman Reigns made for Extreme Rules, which is this weekend. But oh, yeah. Roman attacked Austin before he could get to the ring, before he could say anything. The, yeah, I I was pretty shocked that Roman just attacking Austin Theory out of nowhere. Yeah. Roman, you don't have to keep pulling out these cheap tactics to get me to acknowledge you. You don't need to hide behind your special counsel to talk to me. I'm right here, in the middle of the ring. Oh but. You aren't. Thanks to the Raw GM posting extra security around the arena to make sure you can't show up and attack me tonight. So now that you're not here to ruin it, I can finally say. Roman Reigns. I'll see you at Extreme Rules. In an Extreme Rules match. An Extreme Rules match? An Extreme Whoa. Rules? Extreme Rules match? Roman Reigns versus Austin Theory, that's gonna be a banger. Yeah, Theory has accepted the challenge, and Reigns just isn't here tonight. Oh. Oh, but, you know, we've got some dark matches for you before we get into the juicy action. We wanted to put all of the competitors that are fighting for the Undisputed Championship in competition tonight. So mm -hmm. Seth Rollins will be taking on, he's going one-on-one -on -one with Xavier Woods, who this time has Kofi in his corner. Oh. But uh, this did not go so well for Xavier. Oh. This was like, this was, that, this was like a, this was like a five-minute match. Right. Unfortunately, that went on to end the undefeated streak of uh, the man, of Xavier. I thought for me, you see the man back in lunch. I was like, uh, I don't know about that one, but well, yeah. the man has never won a match yet. That is true. And well, we still had the other two competitors that are guaranteed in. So what do we do? We threw them in a tag team match together. That's Kevin right. Owens versus... No, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn working together. That, tag that... team action. Taking on uh, the tag team that unfortunately lost against the New Day just a few weeks oh. ago for the tag team championships, Imperium, Ludwig Kaiser, Giovanni Vinci. Mm. And this match was a barn burner, tore the house down. Over 20 minutes long they went. But uh, this one went to Imperium. Wow. It seems that uh, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn not able to coexist. It gave Giovanni Vinci and Ludwig Kaiser a big win. Honestly, a win that they, I think they deserved. They, after losing the Tag Team Championship match. They deserved it. They needed it. And now they've staked their claim by beating two people that are going after the Undisputed Championship? The, I mean, I, mm. I would immediately be a top contender if I were one of them. Yeah, I would agree. But it's time for a match with tag team championship implications. Oh boy. RK Bro and the Judgment Day will be going, be duking it out. The team that wins will face the New Day at Extreme Rules in a tables match. The New Day oh. wanted a tables match. They want some tables it, over in Philly. I mean, yeah, true. Philadelphia is known for a lot of hardcore matches. Yeah, they want the tables. So they're going to get the tables. Well. Oh. So only one of these two teams will be able to face the New Day at Extreme Rules. And we're about to find out who to open the show. Let's see who it is. Obviously, it's either... It's uh, RK Bro, or it is Judgment Day with Damian Priest and Finn Balor representing. Now, for some odd reason, they decided to enter separately, and I'm not sure why. Maybe it was to drag things out before the contest. 
Maybe uh, get yeah. their opponents a little less focused. Yeah, usually they enter as a unit, but seems like Damien Priest just wants to uh, have his own entrance being played. Yeah, yeah. I I'm assuming that this is solely to try and get in the heads of RK Bro before the contest. Uh, now, Rhea Ripley is not going to be accompanying them ringside because Rhea Ripley, if you remember from last week, has a steel cage match against Liv Morgan to try and get into the Women's Championship match at Extreme Rules tonight in the main event. Uh, yeah, she has no time to uh, help out the Judgment Day. She's got to she's got to stay focused on that contest that's uh, against Liv Morgan. Steel cage tonight. That's going to be an insane contest. No. Yeah. Knowing the amount of brute force coming from a steel cage match, that's going to be heavy. Like, here comes Finn. Big Finn. Big Finn. Here comes Finn. Also, the contest after this will be the final Undisputed Championship qualifying match. Bobby oh. Lashley will be in action. So, so Bobby Lashley will be probably getting his, uh, his, uh, his, uh, his chance to go for gold, as they say. That's right. Now, just a few weeks ago, Bobby Lashley interrupted Seth Rollins to make uh, the moment about him instead. Because he says, hey, I'm going to qualify now tonight, and I'm going to go to Extreme Rules, and I'm going to win the championship. And you're not going to be able to do anything about it, Seth. And hmm. uh, hopefully for Bobby Lashley, that works out the way he's hoping. Well, let's see. Uh, let's see. Speaking of premium live events, we are just a month, four weeks away from the first dual branded pay-per-view event being a money oh. in the bank. Oh boy. That's right. The road to money in the bank starts on Thursday night SmackDown. Again, the winners of this contest will move on to extreme rules to face the new day in a tables match for the tag team championships. No, it's true. Oh, oh. Whoa, whoa, right away. I think Riddle was going to start this match, but Randy, Randy immediately tagged himself in, gave himself yeah. control, and it immediately didn't work out because Damian Priest just, just jumped at him. Oh, incoming. Huge suplex off of the rip. That's Jesus right. Christ. Big suplex for Damian Priest, and he's going to tag in Finn real quick. No. Oh. <laughs> that, the beginning of the match with Randy Orton and Matt Riddle, that did not seem very coordinated to me. It seemed like Riddle was caught off guard by that. Yeah, but then again, I, I don't know. It could... Randy probably wants to, get, uh, wants to get in there first at the start. So probably some discoordination at the start, but then again, you never know. Yeah, yeah, you never know. Oh, look See? at that. They're, look, they're tagging each other, and they're fine. They're doing fine. They are doing fine. Went for the high knee, didn't quite get any of it, in fact. <laughs> and oh, now oh. Finn has control over Riddle. Oh god. Oh. Oh, Lancing him on the mat with that. <laughs> Again right. comes Damian Priest. There are frequent tag-ins this contest. Went for the leaping clothesline. And now Damian Priest with the kicks to counter that. And Riddle's down. Damian oh, Priest, don't <laughs> Off the ropes, forearm. Oh my goodness. Springboard. That would make AJ Styles proud. Yeah. Uh, reminder for those who, uh, in case you missed it, uh, during Backlash, literally yesterday, AJ Styles retained against Santos Escobar. Not Santos Escobar. Grayson Waller. But Santos was in the corner of Grayson Waller. Now, now. Oh well, that's that's just, that's just a shame. But uh, you know, we're here on Monday Night Raw right now, so. <laughs> oh well, yeah. They just they had to take a quick phone call from SmackDown. Oh my God, the neck breaker there. 
no, nothing, nothing crazy to point out. But, but yeah, I do have to agree uh, with what you said earlier about. Um, seems like uh, overall on SmackDown, I'm just gonna quickly shift the topic. Uh, seems like Grayson Waller has joined uh, the Gal Death Phantasma. Well, yeah, you know, I don't really get it. I don't really understand, but I guess we'll find out more on Thursday. Yeah, well, I guess we're going to have to find out more. Uh, Riddle went for the pin, did not uh, get it there. As this number one contender's oh, match man. for the Tag Team yeah. Championship continues, Riddle is planted. Um, oh, my God. Mm. Almost, almost a three count right there. That could have been a three count oh, there. No. That really maybe even should have. <laughs> Plants him again, going for the pin. One, two. Orton and Balor no. dueling on the outside. Damien Priest Damian... always getting old. That's right. Oh, sorry. Two close counts for Damien Priest again. Riddle with the tackle. Oh my God! Both of these teams are just—they're fighting all over. Oh, yeah, I, I, it looks good, like man. it looks like uh -huh. it looks like Orton swapped in for a quick second. Oh my God! Oh. He just punched Riddle in the face. What the so he hell? Like, I think he was trying to hold. Uh, he was trying to hold Damon Priest. Oh, oh, he, oh my God! Riddle returns the favor, maybe by accident, but a huge clothesline <laughs> makes this. Oh my Jesus. goodness! Complete discord and discordination. From yeah, this is... Randy Orton and Matt Riddle. What is going on? I guess Orton is the legal man now. I I'm going to say yeah. That must have that came pretty quickly. Yeah, uh, the match was probably going super quick. I guess we were because the capital was actually more now. You know, you're a little quiet there, my uh, my commentary partner. Oh, sorry. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Damian Priest with the two count, but not quite all of it. Yeah, seems like a very interesting. I don't know. It looks seems like RK Bro seems like they got everything back together now. Maybe for the moment. Hopefully, wait, wait, wait. hopefully, for the remainder of this contest, they can pull it together. Maybe capture the win against Judgment Day. Absolutely. And you know if they if they get the win here, they they gotta they gotta shape up a bit before uh, Saturday yeah. Sunday yeah. for Extreme Rules this weekend. Yeah. Oh, Riddle with the kicks just, just so. and the chops. Going straight for the chest, my God. Oh, and Finn is down, and Riddle is going to tag in Randy Orton. There we go. Mm, they have had some unfortunate moments this contest, but uh, well, it's, it seems like maybe things are working out for now. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, DDT from Orton. Driving Finn Balor's head into the mat. Oh, it in riddle. We're getting a double tag here. It's Priest and Riddle now. And Riddle going straight for the kicks. Oh, he's got him in the armbar. The leg was just too close to the ropes, though. Not gonna do it for Riddle. Yep. Maybe if that was a little further from the ropes, we could see some number one contenders in RK Bro, but not quite Yao. Not quite Yao. Not quite right now. I don't know why you're saying Yao. Why not? Oh. Now Orton's back in. Looks like Damian Priest is. Oh, he's busted open on the forehead. Ugh, blood. Oh. Pouring out, Orton pulls him in for the clothesline. God, there's so much blood. Yeah, I... there's just so much blood in in these matches that we've had over the past month or so. It's just yeah, they're bleeding all over the place. This is this is an AEW we're talking about. <laughs> oh, um, yeah. I, don't, I don't think any of these men are Dean Ambrose or John Moxley. Uh, just name the same person twice. Like, yes. You sure you're alright? I'm fine. Damien Priest might not be. Nope, he's fine. He got the rope break. Oh. Yeah. Every Good to hear. Everything's rolling onto the outside. Orton over the steps. Okay, he's got Damien Priest in the fireman's carry. Oh, he's going to aggravate oh, that oh, forehead, yeah. I think. Uh oh. What's he going for here? Drives oh, him into the. Oh, I thought he was going to go for a snake eyes there. But no, he just drives Damian Priest into the barrier instead. 
and then whips him toward the outside. Ooh, went for the elbow drop, didn't quite work out. Yeah, it seems like Damon Priest is trying to retaliate. Oh my god. Whips Throwing him into the steps. This is brutal out here right now. They're using everything that they can that won't disqualify them at this point. Seems like Damon, Damon Priest is saying this is over. Uh, saying, Punches hey, this, this is over. Oh my god. Drops him all Jeez. that weight on the leg. Okay, Damien's going to tag in the Finn. Orton's going to wait, and he's going to get a forearm for it. Oh, my God. A little elbow drop there by Finn as he, is, he and the Judgment Day uh, take control of this contest with a small package. Oh. Small package. All but oh. right, Riddle's distracting oh. the ref. Only a one count. Only a one count. Yeah. Maybe thanks to that distraction. Oh. Riddle pop. Not Riddle. Orton pops up. Big clothesline, and now we're back on the outside. And another clothesline to Finn. As Orton has taken this contest. He's taken Finn Balor for a ride. Dropping him on that harsh oh outside. How's he going for here? Oh, D no. T on the outside, oh. driving the head. They're having the skull right into the right into the floor. Oh no! I oh would God. not like to be. Oh, already oh, taunting. Vince Gerenti Orton. And Finn manages to get up, takes his eyes off her. RK out of nowhere. Fuck you! Out of nowhere, and Finn is One, out. Two. Only if only no. two. That RKO legitimately came out of nowhere. Yeah, I have to agree. That the RKO, literally nobody was expecting it. And the fans are loving it as Orton keeps control with a DDT and tags in his partner. Hopefully Riddle can maintain the control that they've built up in these uh, the past uh -oh. little bit. Oh, with the I think that's the Broderick, right? Broderick? <laughs> like, damn. The, uh, bro Derek. Bro yeah. Derek sends Finn down. They're just walloping Finn right now. Uh, What's Finn? Finn oh. needs to get a moment to breathe over the top uh -oh. DDT. DDT. He should be able to tag Damien now. No, he's going to stay in. Sling blade. Sling oh, blade. oh, and the duck, the drop kick. He, Into a drop kick, my god. He might be looking to end this himself. Goes for the pin. But Riddle's you able to it? break it up. Oh. Not even a one count. Riddle breaks it up. And now Riddle and Priest are dueling on the outside. As Finn just... Punching the lights out of Wharton. And Priest is working Jesus. on Riddle. Eating the, yeah. Eating the absolute. Okay, Wharton with the leg uh, the leg twist. Oh, oh he's gonna here. he's gonna work the arm of Finn stomping. Stomping on that hand. Oh, those mm. punches are gonna be a little less effective now. Oh my god, Damian Priest! Big boot to Riddle mm -hmm. after setting him up. Mm -hmm. No! I don't even know. Oh, that was close. It was very close. Only a two count. Why is Riddle just standing out there? He needs to get to the what? apron. He needs to be able to help oh, think, Randy yeah, whenever he needs it. Yep, he's getting there. He's just picking him in a second. Fall away slam from Orton, and he's he's looking to end this now. Oh, one, two. Oh, that's that's, that's the end. Off of a fall away that. slam, RK Bro. Takes the oh Riddle's upset. No. Why is what's what? Why is Riddle so upset? I don't. I, they won no, the match. Yeah, oh, they won the match. Oh, Riddle just walks away. They won the match. They won the number one contendership. They will face the new day at Extreme Rules. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Heyman, and I am the special counsel for Your Excellency, the Tribal Chief Roman Reigns. Roman is very grateful for being gifted the opportunity to eviscerate Austin Theory to dust at extreme rules. However, Roman has not only been thinking of himself, frequently requesting an opportunity for his enforcer Solo Sikoa, and with this I am proud to announce, at extreme rules, Solo Sikoa will be in the middle of the ring, and any amount of men can answer the challenge for an over-the-top rope battle royal, and to sweeten the deal, the winner will be crowned your first. United States Champion, though there is no doubt in my mind Solo Sokoa will be holding the United States Championship by the end of the night.
a U.S. Well, Championship Battle Royal hosted by Solo Sokoa for well, Extreme well. Rules. Oh, who's going to accept the challenge for the U.S. That, Open Challenge? That, honestly, that's an interesting move by uh, the Special Counsel, Paul Heyman. That's right. Anyone can answer the challenge. Any amount of men. It could be just one. It could be an over-the-top battle royal between Solo Sokoa and the Hurricane, for all I know. Or we could get a Royal Rumble amount of people. 30-man over-the-top rope. I mean, any any amount of people can answer that challenge. Yeah, I can agree. But any amount. It could be a Royal Rumble where it's 30, or it could be literally a one-on-one -on -one. <laughs> over the top rope contest that's right but for now i think lashley might be a little upset that he is not the center of attention at this moment because he is about to in his own words he is about to qualify for the wwe undisputed championship ladder match at extreme rules of course we he's, we're not sure who his opponent is we're not no, we're, we're not even to... sure if he's gonna win oh well, we're about to find out pretty quickly got <gasps> it's no, the king. it's the king of strong style we haven't seen shinsuke since the world heavyweight championship tournament he, yeah it, it's it's been a while he won his first match he lost his second one he lost to aj styles in fact in yeah, a wrestlemania a, rematch a wrestlemania rematch but now nakamura is here he is back on monday night raw just in time to potentially qualify for the WWE Undisputed Championship match. Honestly, I would say from one from one man to another, I, I would honestly put my money on Shinsuke. This man brought it all to the World Heavyweight uh, Championship Tournament. Even though, yes, he didn't win the tournament, AJ did. I, I have a pretty good feeling he will win this contest against uh, Bobby Lashley. Honestly, it could go either way, but with the contestants we already have, Seth Rollins, Sami Zayn, Kevin Owens, either of these men, Shinsuke or Bobby, will add, oh, will just add something great to that contest, I'm sure. Whoever gets in yeah, uh, will deserve it. Honestly, I would agree more. That's right, it's one-on-one. -on -one. It's Bobby Lashley. <laughs> And it's Shinsuke Nakamura finally back on Monday nights. Oh, yeah, no, Jesus oh, Christ. No. Yeah. Oh, no. Seems like Bobby Lashley putting already the F, like, getting the work in already. Damn, clothesline flattens him and then just tosses him. Oh, no. <laughs> Nakamura hasn't been able to get a lick of offense, and he's already on the ground. It's only been a couple of, like, ten seconds, maybe. Hmm. Bobby Lashley is all over the King of Strong style. Well, finally, man, just, oh, but he was a punch. And Lashley, there we go. Nakamura able to fight out of the fireman's carry. Forearm, but, oh no, the knee to the gut. This is a fierce contest already. Lashley yeah, goes out of Shinsuke's fireman's carry, lifts him up. Oh my god. Oh um, no, uh, showing the display of power from Bobby Lashley. Display of power, lifts him up, huge slam, going for the One, pin. One, two, oh, that, was, that was pretty close. Already a two count though against Shinsuke Nakamura. I do not <laughs> like the Giga Strong Styles odds early on in this contest. Big yeah, I, I, but it, it as well, Shinsuke's not been on Raw for a little bit while since the tournament. So it's it maybe a little while for him to get his bearings back. That's right. He is the king of strong style. He is also the king of comebacks. I mean, that that's, is true. it's not an official name, but I'm I'm saying that he's the king of comebacks, which means it's enough. Plants Lashley a two count of his own. Hey. Yeah, two count already. Surprisingly even contest between these two right now. Oh, uh -oh. is he already? Oh, no. Is he going he for it? happy feet. Is coming? Went for the key no. but no, the leg sweep by Bobby is going to take Bye. him down. Oh. And now Bobby's got control again. Oh, no. I got a bad feeling about this one. 
No, Shinsuke able to oh, no. weasel his way out of a tough predicament. Oh, but Lashley's got him right back up in the, in the fireman's carry. And Snake Eyes on the turnbuckle in the corner. Jesus. Oh, and he's just he's, actively trying to decimate Shinsuke Nakamura. That's right, restricting him to the corner. Giving him very little room to breathe. Lashley has not given Shinsuke a moment. We got the Hurt Lock. Oh, no. Hurt Lock's in. The, the hurt, hurt Lock's in. The Hurt Lock is locked in. Will Shinsuke be able to... Oh, my God. I don't know if Shinsuke can get out of this. Well, this is this is one of the many moves that a lot of people are not able to escape. That's Will he tap? Shinsuke struggling. Oh, gets the foot. Oh. Stunner. Stunner. <laughs> Shinsuke Stunner <laughs> to get out of the Hurt Lock. Oh no, bang, good night. Yeah, that did not work out for long. Oh, what's yeah, Bobby Bobby's, thinking? Bobby's Through the, oh my god! Jesus! Lashley went over the top rope, he went flying, and Shinsuke was not there for the landing. <laughs> oh. I, I, no. oh no, what's he, oh no, what, what, what's this man, oh going no, to something that er, incoming. No way, Bobby Lash is gonna leap off the top rope right now. Oh, oh Jesus! Axe hand, double axe handle. And now just, oh my God, this contest went to the outside. As soon as this contest went to the outside, it got much more ferocious. It was still a very hard hitting, ferocious contest, but things got much worse on the outside. Now we're finally back in the ring. Lashley Irish Whip sends Shinsuke to the ropes, and a sidewalk mm -hmm. slam could spell the end. One, two, no, it's not. Does not spell the end for Shinsuke, only a two count. As Lashley, oh no, could we see oh, another? No. I think we're going to see another Hurt Lock. He's got him in the Hurt Lock yeah, again. Yeah, he's got it in. And he's Wait. squirming, he's struggling. Yeah, yeah, I don't know yeah. if he can actually break oh. out of this one. I don't think he's going to be breaking out of this one. I, I don't think so either. Oh my god, this is a ferocious one. He's just tossing his opponent around. He's tossing and turning him. I don't Making sure he's just wearing him down. No, seems like Shinsuke's getting out of it. Shinsuke Another managed. Shinsuke's oh, no. That's right, manages to break out of it again. Shinsuke with control, leans Lashley against the ropes. Here? Couple kicks to the, to the leg. What's he going for here? Kick, yeah, big kick across the chest. Now working the arm. The arm of Lashley being worked. Oh my goodness. This contest has been Lashley through and through. Shinsuke's had his moments, but not a lot. Not 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 too many, but Shinsuke Shinsuke's known pretty well that's, to get a comeback off of this. That's right, he's got the arm twisted back. Oh, but Lashley. Lashley with the punches and the shoulder bump. Jeez, uh, what's he going for? Got oh, no. wrench. Got oh, wrench yeah, screwdriver? I think, I think that is it. One, two. two. Only a two count. No! Only a two count. Lash Bobby really. Lashley's got to really dig down deep just to, to put away Shinsuke. Oh, and I think that's oh, what no. he's about to do. Shinsuke's he... standing. Oh, I think he went for the hurt lock, but no, Shinsuke managed to counter immediately. Shinsuke, oh, what was he, what was oh, he setting no. up there? He, he was trying, I think he was trying to go for the King Shaza. He's like, Bobby, know that he was going for it. Sends him up to plant Lashley down, tossing him back down onto the mat. Oh, I think Shinsuke was trying to set him up for it, but Bobby... Oh, you, Shinsuke's thinking top right here. Anymore. Let's Double axe handle of his own to drop Bobby Lashley. Jesus. And now that's Ooh, the gosh. furious stomp. Stop what him. a match so far. What a contest. Oh, boy, this is... Got a three count on the outside. Shinsuke, help. they're going to get back in. They don't, they don't want to risk anything with the count. Yeah. Oh, seems like they were going for a suplex. Bobby yeah. countered. Yeah, Bobby rolled through Fine. the German, I believe. Yeah, German. Suplex. Yeah, German suplex, yeah. Jesus. Shinsuke with the uh -oh. knee, but could he be going? Shinsuke's calling. Oh, no. It seems, 
No, Shinsuke was gonna go for it, but I think it like, seems like Bobby was getting up. Yeah, Lashley was a little more ready than Shinsuke was expecting. What is his plan here? Rolls him through. Oh! Armbar. Armbar. Huge armbar from Shinsuke Nakamura. Lashley. Oh my god, Shinsuke had been working the arm for so long, but it, it didn't work out just there. Yeah, seems... Oh, oh. Colliding, but not here? getting anything. Oh my god. Yes, yeah, driving his back into the knee. And oh, seems now like Shinsuke's Stim going to the corner. He's thinking, we go. he's thinking Kinshasa, will we see it? Will we finally see it? Kinshasa connects. Kinshasa. It connects. Could this be the end? What the fuck is that pin? I don't know what type of pin is that, but it's a pin. Whatever it no. is, Lashley kicked out of it. Oh no, no. the Kinshasa wasn't enough. The, the awkward pin wasn't enough. Not really awkward pin. Uh, but now. I don't know what. what... Both? Oh no. Oh my god, going both, right after you are. Both of these men gotta be thinking what is going to end this contest. It has been going on for some time now. But only one can win. Oh no. No! Oh my god. Right back on the outside and Lashley's gonna follow suit. Uh oh. I think he's gonna try to put him through the announcer's table. Nope, right back to the inside, actually. And nope. in for the yeah. pin. In for a pit. One, two. That's, hey, that's the it. match. Three. Sending wow. him off the apron was enough. Shinsuke will not be going to Extreme Rules for the WWE Undisputed Championship, but Bobby Lashley made good on his promise to Seth. We'll see Bobby taking on Seth Rollins, Sami Zayn, and Kevin Owens in that Undisputed Championship ladder match at Extreme Rules. Yeah. Well, I guess Bobby, what Bobby said is it's true. He's going to dominate and win the WWE Undisputed Championship. Yeah, Extreme Rules just a week, oh, less than a week away. It's this Saturday and Sunday, parts one and part two. Yeah. And it's just about main event time. Lashley successful. Who will be successful between Rhea Ripley and Liv Morgan? That is the question the main event will answer. Let's see. Wait, wait, hold on a second. I'm, I'm getting, what? I'm getting word of an altercation backstage. Oh no, this. Can't. Oh. Oh my God, Roman Reigns is here. How did Roman oh Reigns get in? God. How did he get in here? Oh no, in theory. What is the security on Money Night Raw? Oh, my God. The GM paid for extra security. What is happening here? Oh Jesus no, Christ. he's a. Hey, Destroying Austin Theory with the ch Austin Theory's. How long has this been going for? Oh no. I I feel bad for Austin Theory. Just Roman oh, absolutely packing no. shit out of him. Roman Reigns sending Theory a message that it's his time at Extreme Rules. But for now, ah, oh, it's Steel Cage time. Oh boy. Liv Morgan and Rhea Ripley, they've been at each other's throats for the past couple of weeks now. Ever since the first episode of Raw where Liv Morgan said, Hey, I'm going to be the champion. And Rhea Ripley said, No, you're not. <laughs> and uh, ever since then, they've been interfering in their own qualifying matches. Ripley was not successful in hers, but Liv, Liv Morgan was. And so Liv, she wanted to send this off right. She said, Rhea Ripley, I want to face you before Extreme Rules. Rhea said, only if you put your shot at the Women's Championship on the line. And Liv said, yes. So that's what's happening here. Rhea Ripley, Liv Morgan, Steel Cage. Their shot at the Women's Championship on the line. Oh boy. The winner will go on to Extreme Rules to face Charlotte Flair and Beth Phoenix. Just just knowing that Rhea is now able to probably get win this match. If she wins this match tonight, she just she goes after after Beth Phoenix, who she lost to. Yes. In her qualifying match. And including Charlotte Flair. 
That's right. She would have to go through the queen and she would have to go through the person that beat her. But before any of that, she has to go through Liv Morgan. Yeah, that is true. Oh, Liv Morgan is uh, no joke. N nothing to be trifled with is Liv Morgan. Yeah. This she is, is a good fighter. This is going to be a barn burner, I'm sure. I would agree. Especially since Liv Morgan wants to keep that shot at the Women's Championship. And Rhea, this is Rhea's last chance to get into that match. If she can be successful, then she has a shot at the Women's Championship this weekend. Well. Let's for anything we I... have to see. Oh my god! Ripley oh my. immediately Please. not taking us a moment to rest. Tackles Liv Morgan to the ground. And just Jesus. tosses her oh around. Rhea just Ripley. Yeah, she... her. That's right, she's immediately taking control of this contest. Oh what a my. what a fierce clothesline. Oh no. I mean I feel uh, like if I were Liv... Oh, no. If I were Liv, I would be regretting accepting this challenge from Rhea Ripley right now. I would, I would honestly kind of regret it as well because you already got to have your ticket punched to Extreme Rules. I don't know what kind of, uh, I don't know. what kind of, I, I don't, I, I just don't know. I guess Liv probably feels like she has something to prove to Rhea Ripley, but I, you know, going under that, I feel like that is probably, oh. Liv. Oh, what, what's she going for here? Heads, Hurricane Rana. Heads is Hurricane Rana. Maybe Liv can get some control, but I don't know. I, I feel like maybe Rhea Ripley's words have been getting to her, to Liv. Oh. Then again, you do have a What is she going for here? She's looking to end this early. She's looking to go up. To, she's looking to scale the, scale the steel cage. Oh, my God. Say that and... so fast. Yeah. Jesus. Yep, Rhea's working the leg. <laughs> That goes for the pin. One. Only a no. one count. Nothing Only too a one count. Nothing too crazy. And Rhea seems to be surprised, but you know, I wouldn't be. Liv Morgan was able to defeat <laughs> Natalia. Jesus. She was able to defeat Natalia to get here. <laughs> you, it took you that long just to remember. <laughs> hey, man, I'm sorry. There's a lot of female. <laughs> I barely remember I half. I barely remember half of the males. Excuse me for forgetting one female. No, I mean you're not wrong. It's a, it's a hard thing to manage a roster. Yes, of, uh, it people. is. Yes, oh, it is. Oh my. Another one count gets Rhea nowhere in this contest. Jesus. I'll live with the roll through kick, tossing Rhea down. I don't know. At this point, you gotta put you gotta put your opponent down for long enough to scale the cage, or you gotta put them down heavily enough to just pin Code Breaker by Jeez. Liv. Oh. That could be the final message to Rhea saying, "I bested you." But Rhea, oh my God, Rhea's already standing up. Rhea's already getting up. Rhea's. Um, what what's she going for here? Oh no, Liz. Grabs her opponent and power bomb yeah. through them. Oh no. Oh no. Rhea's looking to end this herself. Oh my god. That's her own finisher. What the hell? One, two, no. Barely. Barely. A t barely. Not enough. That was, that was a 2.9, and the crowd is loving this. They are feeling this contest. Just absolutely going right after her. Jesus Christ. Rhea Ripley, she wants this woman's championship match. She lost to Beth. She needs to beat Liv if she wants to make it. I mean, honestly, she she loses to Beth. I mean, yeah, you could line. get your chance another time, but I, mean, I, I just don't know. I'll live with a double clothesline, leg sweep. How? You, you gotta wonder, what is it gonna take to. Oh! Oh, oh my god. god. Back collides with steel in the harshest way imaginable. Rhea's going for the pin One, again. Two. I think that's it. No. Another 
Uh, I'd say that's more like a 2.75 as opposed to a 2.9. Yeah. Rhea's that asking for the. Like, oh, she, she asked for the door to be open, no. and then. Yeah, I don't think she realized Liv was right there to immediately prevent that. Well, still trying oh, to go for Liv here. Head scissors, Hurricane Rana again. I highly doubt that a head scissors, Hurricane One, Rana is going to put two, Rhea Ripley out. No. I'm not surprised. I am not surprised that was not enough. Oh, was she trying to go for that? No. Kick, but Rhea was able to counter. Oh, Liv rolls through, though, with a kick to the back of the leg. Legs, reverse Russian leg sweep. Yeah. Irish whip sends Liv toward the ropes, and a drop kick drops her. And I Jesus. think Rhea believes that is going to be enough to end this contest. I think so, too. She's, it probably is. Looking for a foothold. Oh, she's climbing up. Oh, but it seems Liv. like uh, Liv's trying to get up there quickly. Liv's chance might be... Oh, what is she... Oh, my God. Liv's chance might be over at this point. No, she, she's able to get to Rhea. Just barely in <laughs> yeah, time. She's, she's able to get to her. Just barely enough in time. Barely able to get to her. Pull her down. Just in time to keep her women's championship. Number one contendership alive. She's going to climb. He's going to try to take a chance at it. Oh, Rhea's joining her. They're side by side. They're they're just climbing. Oh, no. Rhea is... Oh, I, I don't see. Unless Rhea does something yeah, here. This is really going to be close. No, she's... Oh Rhea's going to prevent it. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> One of these women will lose. The other will win. No. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is it. Off That's the it. top of the steel cage. Wait, unless... Hold it. I don't think so. It's no. No, that is it. Rhea slides out. I think this is the end. We're waiting. Yeah, hold it. She has to touch the ground. Liv watches as Rhea Ripley. Liv watches as Rhea Ripley steals her number one contendership for the women's championship. Oh my goodness! It will be Charlotte Flair, Beth Phoenix, and Rhea Ripley. At Extreme Rules this weekend. Oh, what a brutal oh, loss dear for Liv. God. Yeah, I, I am. Oh, I I'm it. just in awe. All right, really quick reminder we have Extreme Rules this weekend, part one on Saturday, part two on Sunday. But before that, Thursday night SmackDown. The aftermath of Backlash. What will happen? What's the deal with the God of? Del Fantasma. We will see you on Thursday. We'll see you then.